Hi guys and welcome back. So today I'm going to show you how to change the external static pressure for the Mitsubishi Electric Indoor Units. This procedure, by the way, is intended for authorized Mitsubishi Electric Technicians. If you get value from this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. So the reason why we want to change the external static pressure can be for the following. Let's see at this example here for a given indoor unit with external static pressure factory setting A that we can increase it to B, C and so on. So for this duct length the external static pressure A will give us the rated airflow rate. But what if the actual length of the duct is this? In this case the airflow rate will decrease. So in order to get the rated airflow again, we need to increase the external static pressure of the indoor unit to B. So here is how we do it. For VRF indoor units type PFY, we do it by changing dip switches. Please see the attached lesson at the description for split type PAD, JAL and SEZ KD, we do it by changing function setting mode 08 and mode 10. Let's look at the example here. We will take the PEAD JAL indoor unit and we will change the factory setting 50 Pascal, we will increase it to 70 Pascal. So we need to change mode 08 from setting 3 to setting 1 and we also need to change mode 10 from factory setting 1 to setting 2. Turn the RC off Press here two seconds continuously. Wait till you see it blinking. Press here once, press here, press here, separate time till you get AL. Press here to save. 408, press here, move it to 1. Save, return for other mode, press here for mode 10, press here to change, move it to 2, save and exit 2 seconds continuously. That's it. If you have comments or questions, please leave them below. Have a nice day and see you soon. Bye bye.